Welcome back to my channel, Technology in the Future. Today, we delve into the astonishing revelations about Nikon's upcoming camera, the Nikon Z90. This highly anticipated model is set to revolutionize the APS-C mirrorless camera market, and there's so much to unpack. Stick around as we explore its potential features, the challenges Nikon faces, and how the Z90 might solidify Nikon's position in a fiercely competitive industry. Breaking down the Nikon Z90, an unexpected influx of information has emerged about Nikon's forthcoming APS-C mirrorless camera, the Nikon Z90. While the name isn't officially confirmed, insiders suggest a release date as early as August or September 2025, perhaps even sooner if everything aligns. So, what can we expect from this revolutionary device? A new high-resolution DX sensor. Nikon is reportedly developing a cutting-edge DX format sensor tailored for its flagship APS-C camera. Leveraging its reputation for rigorous testing and prototype development, Nikon aims to deliver a camera that stands out in both performance and versatility. Early reports indicate the Z90 will feature a 33-megapixel APS-C sensor capable of 15 frames per second, FPS, and 4K video recording. This new model appears poised to replace the legendary Nikon D500. Adding to its appeal, the Z90 is expected to include dual card slots, one for XQD cards and another for SD cards, making it a versatile choice for professional photographers. Semi-flagship status, the Baby Z9, often affectionately dubbed the Baby Z9, the Z90 is designed as a semi-flagship APS-C mirrorless camera. Its rumored specs and features suggest it could directly compete with Canon's EOS R7, ensuring Nikon stays competitive in the high-end mirrorless market. The true allure of this camera lies not just in its hardware, but in the customization and reliability it offers to seasoned photographers. Wildlife enthusiasts and action shooters, in particular, will appreciate its advanced autofocus and speed, which echo the performance of Nikon's flagship models like the Z9. The challenges facing Nikon. Nikon faces a crucial crossroads as it seeks to maintain relevance in an evolving market. The transition from DSLR to mirrorless technology has been a significant hurdle for many traditional camera manufacturers, including Nikon. While their Z-mount system has gained traction, the brand must ensure it continues to innovate to compete with giants like Sony and Canon, addressing the mirrorless revolution. Historically, Nikon dominated the DSLR market with models like the D500 and D850. However, the rise of mirrorless cameras reshaped the industry, forcing Nikon to rethink its strategy. Cameras like Sony's Alpha 7 RV have set new benchmarks, leaving Nikon with the challenge of catching up in terms of both technology and market share. Nikon's unique opportunity. Nikon has a chance to capitalize on its storied legacy by integrating the best features of its DSLR lineup into its mirrorless offerings. For the Z90, this means providing the reliability and customization of the D500 while enhancing features like autofocus, video capabilities, and lens compatibility. The introduction of a ZDX camera that doesn't compromise on quality could be a game changer for Nikon. Nikon's lens strategy. To make the Z90 a true contender, Nikon needs to expand its Z-mount lens lineup. Photographers have called for versatile options, including wide-angle and mid-range zoom lenses, to fully exploit the camera's potential. Without these additions, even the most advanced body could fall short in attracting new users. A decade of transformation. Nikon's journey over the past decade has been marked by highs and lows. As a pioneer of DSLR technology with the groundbreaking D1, Nikon was once the industry leader. However, the company's reluctance to embrace mirrorless technology early led to missed opportunities. Learning from the past. Nikon initially underestimated the impact of mirrorless cameras, focusing instead on the compact market. This miscalculation coincided with Sony's rise, as the Alpha series gained dominance. When Nikon shifted focus, its market share and revenue significantly declined. The road ahead. To regain its footing, Nikon has prioritized profitability and diversification. The imaging division, which once accounted for 75% of the company's revenue, is now part of a broader strategy to reduce dependence on a single sector. Cameras like the Z90 represent a key element of this plan, as Nikon seeks to deliver innovative products that resonate with both professionals and enthusiasts. What the Z90 means for Nikon's future. The Nikon Z90 isn't just another camera. 
It's a statement about Nikon's ambitions and resilience. By incorporating features like a 33 megapixel sensor, dual card slots, and advanced video capabilities, Nikon aims to set a new standard in the APS-C category. Why it matters? The Z90's success could reinvigorate Nikon's presence in the mirrorless market. For photographers, it offers a powerful tool that bridges the gap between DSLRs and mirrorless systems. For Nikon, it's an opportunity to demonstrate that the brand can still innovate and lead in a competitive industry. What do you think about the upcoming Nikon Z90? Are its rumored features enough to make it a game changer? Share your insights in the comments below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest in camera technology.